I started playing football when I was about 10 because there was like a tournament that was going to happen like in a few weeks. So me and my friends, we all decided, let's just do it. And then that's how I got started. My dad and my grandma were always very interested in football. So it was kind of like we talked about it a lot, but I never really like was like, oh yeah, I want to do that until I went to the tournament. And then after that, I came home and I was like, oh dad, I want to play football. And then we signed up. Me and my friends made a team together and yeah, and then I've, I'm one of the only ones that has continued to play, apart from my other friend who we're playing today. So there's a bit of competition. Football's a very skillful game and I think I've just found like girls in like running and like just fitness. I feel like it's really improved with playing football because obviously we play for 90 minutes, so it's just constant running, sprinting to get those balls and things. I just enjoy the fitness and I enjoy the social aspect and being with my friends and I just like it's just fun to be around friends and you know you can laugh but you, there's also like competitiveness. Football kind of did make me more competitive. I feel like there's always been a part of me that's been very competitive. Growing up with sisters we just we compete <laughs> a lot and with playing football going for those tackles and like getting the shots on and things it's just like you got it it's just like thrilling and you're just like yeah I play football because it just makes you feel better and I may have not had the best day at school I'm like oh, I'm gonna go to football and I'm just gonna have fun and like sometimes if I'm like not feeling like I'm like oh I don't really want to go I know that when I do go I feel so much better and it makes my day and if you enjoy it and if you have a good group of friends that kind of play with you, it's it just like, it's a good thing. It makes you feel good. So we're playing Wests today and I'm feeling really good. I've been a little ill for the past few days, but I'm feeling better today and I'm ready to play football. Um, I also have exams this week, so I just, I'm gonna take today and just play football and just enjoy it before a busy, stressful week. The players you have normally dictates the shape that you play, right? So we're short of a couple of centre backs. So we felt we could get away with playing three at the back, all right? So we're gonna go with a 3-5-2. What I want to try and do is play right down the middle, because that's where we have most players. If you think the best option is play it out, then play it out, right, if you've got someone running. I'd like you all to focus on 1v1s. Every single game is made through 1v1s, right? It is your ball in a 50-50, even a 40-60, it is still your ball. Go in as though you mean it, right? Not like, oh, I might get hurt. You're more likely to get hurt on a 1v1 if you go in thinking you'll get hurt and fall back. Everything is yours. Play simple football, be competitive. It's your ball, 1v1s are ours, right? Have fun while you're doing it, because that is critically important, all right? And let's really try to score some goals too. All right, own it.
I, I strongly apologise, it came off a lot more blunt and brutal than it was meant to. I was a bit frustrated because I had talked to some of the players during the half, and it's still continuing. I just want you to be more careful, please. Yeah? Okay? Thank you. Do take note of the offside um, and just know second to last player, right? So you stand shoulder to shoulder and you're fine, and then you move. If you're really quick, Phoebe, stand a metre behind that second to last player. I've seen professional games where they've been called off so 10, 12 times, and the rest haven't yeah. said anything. Well, I, I think it's a little bit harsh, so I said to a little bit harsh. Yeah, what's going well, what's not going well? Passing's looking good. We are involved with some line on the play, and so we're actually starting to be good. Uh, we're pushing the ball forward, we're playing through the middle, right? And we've got the We've had shots, which is the only thing we haven't got is goals. Look up before you shoot if you can, right? And can you take an extra couple of touches to get a little bit closer, right? Um, but on the whole, it's looking good what you're doing. The, the goals will come. Great second half, right? As soon as we got that first goal, it seemed as though they just opened the tap, right? So it just it just happened, and we just started playing a little bit more positively. We actually started um, wanting it a little bit more, and that's what I think is key: is that desire just to go hard, right? And and I think that second half was by far the best that we played for a while. Um, so nicely done. Hannah is now our highest goal scorer. And either that was a left footed goal, right? Really good. Next week is our last game of the season for the league. It means we'll either finish fourth or fifth, right? And if we default back to what we said at the beginning of the season, we wanted to finish mid-table, and we've hit that goal, so that's, that's really good. Right, hey, good game, everybody. Second half, take that, bottle it, find something that you can do better next week and build on that and reflect on the things that you did really well this week.